Hello adventurers, in today's video I came to bring you a recurring theme in the comments. We're going to bring you what we know about Hytale's release date and a little of our vision on the topic, so come with me. Before you start, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and activate the bell so you don't miss any news about Hytale. To start, we need to understand a little more about Hytale's development history. The Hytale team sought to become the company they needed to be to meet the community's expectations. They evolved from a modding team into a professional game development studio. The acquisition by Riot Games was an important step that provided essential resources. They opened a physical office during the pandemic. They are doing everything they can to comply with everything said about Hytale. In the blog post, they state this and say that. The timing may be a little questionable. 2,000 years later. In 2020, they were unable to operate at 100% capacity, and we believe that this disrupted the team's schedule, as it was a very chaotic year with many uncertainties. What is clearly visible in the blog posts is the team's determination to expand to operate at full steam and deliver us something of quality, including many fans, are afraid of this, let's say perfection, that they want to deliver to us, and of Hytale, continuing to be stuck in development for many years. But we believe that we are not very far from at least a beta, this is a personal opinion. I believe that perhaps this year, or at most until next year, we will have a beta in our hands. Especially because the tests have already started and some lucky people had the chance to play Hytale, this is a sign that our journey is very close to starting in the world of Orbis. The team's intentions are that they want to ensure that all of Hytale's systems are coherent, fun, and advance the genre in a meaningful way. In the blog post from 2020, they said that when they were confident about the launch plan, they would be specific about it, because there is a tendency to make predictions based on supposed clues. But in this regard, they made it clear that they would specific. So what's still missing? Well. In the last blog post, they said they were spending more time to build flexible systems and processes so that creators can act quickly when those systems are ready. The next big step was to prepare another wave of resources for internal testing as more systems come online. They also said they have significantly expanded the team since the last update, which also takes time. Everyone who added the team is a vital part of the mission. It's an investment that's worth it for both sides. They invest their time, energy, and experience, and do their best to make all this waiting worthwhile for us. Now I would like to know in the comments what you think about the release date. Do you agree with my opinion? Do you think we will have access to the beta by next year? Tell us your opinion in the comments. If you liked the video, like it. Comment and share with your friends who will embark on this adventure with you. Until next time, adventurers.